It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Delirium Tremens and it's the Delirium Christmas coming in at 10% ABV. Silver foil neck. Lovely painted bottle. Really like their bottles. Merry Christmas to everybody. I'll be posting this on Christmas Day. So Merry Christmas to you all. I hope you have a lovely Christmas and a very Merry Happy New Year. Let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get. Wow, loads of smoke on the opening there. Let's get some of this beer in the glass. There you go. What a lovely looking beer. Lovely clear beer nice rolling carbonation it's a one finger head it's a deep amber colored ale almost looks like a, a cherry red mahogany color let's get the aroma and that's powerful really really powerful it's something that can only be described as belgian So loads of spice, it's very perfume, slightly alcoholic, but again you need that, um, I think a 10% ABV, it would be rude not to kind of have a little bit of an alcohol kick on the beer. Loads of candied sugar, loads of spice. It smells wonderful and it's starting to smell very familiar and I like that because it took me so long to enjoy these Belgian beers but it's something now that I've learned to love and enjoy so let's dive in. Cheers everybody. Very dry beer dry tasting beer, it's citrusy in a very Belgian way, there's loads of that candied sugar, that sweetness I was talking about, there's plum, there's fig, there's pepper, lemon, there's a lovely alcohol kick to the beer it warms as it goes down the mouthfeel is fantastic it's lovely it's really really nice I'm not going to pour all the beer out into the glass today I'd love to show you the, the sediment but I've promised to keep some for my dear wife my beer reviewing wife, craft beer lady, she wants to try this, but at this stage of the review I'd like to thank our channel sponsors beersofeurope.co.uk, the largest online beer store in the UK where you can get all these lovely fancy fantastic beers from around the world including this lovely little Belgium number. So over the Christmas period, over in the new year, be sure to check out beersofeurope.co.uk, great online beer store. Let's talk about the carbonation then with this beer. I think for a Belgium triple slash Belgium quad, you don't want too much carbonation. You want enough carbonation just to kind of lift the beer and not have the beer being flat. You don't want too much, you don't want it fizzing away. It's enough. It's really enough. It kind of tingles on the mouth. It's an uplifting feeling. I'm really picking up. I paused for a second there and that was the warming in my stomach. I was thinking, wow, this really is a nice winter warmer. I've done a 10 hour shift today in work. Really long kind of 10 hour shift. Um, bit of a slog. 
so I'm enjoying this today. It's cold outside, it's been cold all day. I work in a cold environment in work. And this is a real nice winter warmer. This is really warming me, warming me from the inside out. So that lovely perfumed, citrusy, warming nose on the beard is great. I'm going to go ahead and rate it. Let's finish this glass of beer with you guys. Merry Christmas. That is absolutely perfect. It's like nectar. It probably took me a few months to get into this particular beer style. Maybe even a year. But now I'm hooked. Absolutely hooked. Whenever I go to beer stores, whenever I go to beer festivals, I'm always on the lookout for Belgian beer. I love my IPAs, always pick up my IPAs also, but I've always got my eye, or I'm always looking for a Belgian beer, whether it be a double, triple, quadruple, blonde, broom, anything, really damn good beers of Belgian beers, and this lives up to that reputation for me. They, this is a fantastic beer. It's... One that I'm glad I posted on Christmas Day. Christmas Eve slash Christmas Day. It's fantastic. Go out and try it. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So 9 out of 10 from me, Lil Craft Beer. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.